Right now at 6, busted stealing Trump yard signs. A central Indiana man catching people on tape, though his latest campaign catch took an unexpected turn and ended in a violent confrontation. The homeowner didn't let the would-be thief get away easily. RTV6 State House reporter Katie Hines is live on the Old North side with a story you'll see only on RTV6. Yeah, the owner of a house in this neighborhood is beefing up his home security system after catching four separate attempts. Four people trying to steal the Trump signs from his front yard. And tonight he has a message for anyone who's thinking about setting foot on his property. This video is from early Friday morning. You can make out a person walking into the front yard and attempting to snag a Trump sign. He gets away after wrestling with the sign for a full 20 seconds, but he doesn't make it far. He had to pull the stakes out of the ground, and he got about to my neighbor's tree before it, it snagged him. The now tattered Trump sign is latched down with green fishing wire. We first introduced you to the owner, Philip, last month when he caught this would be thief on camera. I run the wires, you know, around the tree or around a rock or something different. So they, if, if the same person comes back, they're going to have to, they're going to have to hunt for where it's, where it's tethered down to. Little did he know the first attempt wouldn't be the last on Friday. About 6 p.m., Philip spotted someone trying again live on his home surveillance system. Somebody was jogging right up my, my drive and was grabbing my sign. By the time he got to the front door, the man had given up and run away. Philip followed. So I went up to him and, and asked him why they were trying to steal my, my yard sign, and of course they denied it. He pledged to keep the would-be sign stealer in sight while his wife called the police. You can see the two jog past the house twice. At one point, an acquaintance of the would-be thief joins, and things turn physical. I guess he, he decided he didn't want me following him, so he immediately turns and shoves me with both hands, knocks me down. Philip says the pair ran into a nearby apartment building before police got there. And now he has this message for anyone else who tries to take his sign. You're on camera, have fun. And Philip has filed a police report after they or a police report after they arrived here on the scene last week. He says that he would like to press charges. He would also like to see more done to denounce political yard sign thefts. Katie Hines, RTV6. Katie, thank you. We are working for you to find out your rights as a homeowner for displaying political signs in your yard. The Marion County Prosecutor's Office confirms a person who's caught stealing a sign could potentially be charged with trespass and theft, both misdemeanors. A theft charge could result in punishment of up to a year in jail and a $5,000 fine. New development.